It is Monday, and I feel much better. That being said, I am very much in Cough City right now. It is time for me to drive for Lyft for a bit. Well, that was a bit of a learning experience. I started driving at like 12, 12, 15, something like that, and I am now done, and it's like 3.35 or something like that. It was so slow. It just was not worth my time being out there. Like, in the three and a half hours of me driving, I had three rides. And two of them were like together. It was like a lift line thing where I had they were separate rides, but there were two people in the same car, in my car at the same time. Uh, I hope that makes sense. But three rides, and it was just like this is not, you know, this is not worth my time. There's some editing stuff I could be doing. I could be looking for other editing work back here and stuff. So I was just like. I'm going home. And I realized I had the app still on when I was on the way back, when I was coming back here. And uh, a pass, like a, a ride popped up and I was like, oh my goodness, do I take it? It was like 11 minutes away. So I was like, do I, do I snag it or not? And before, before the little timer, the, every time a, a new ride pops up, you have like, I don't know, 15, 20 seconds to grab it or let it just pass on by. And before I was even halfway through the timer, it went away. Which made me believe that there are more Lyft drivers out there than just me today. <laughs> which there obviously are. But I just never thought of that before. Like, crud. Maybe, you know, I think Mondays are slow as it is. But it's even a holiday, and so I'm under the belief that there are quite a few Lyft drivers out there today, all trying to grab every passenger available. So it's just like, this, this isn't worth it. So I'm going to do some editing stuff for the rest of the afternoon. Okay, it <coughs> okay so it is a bit later now. I am on the way to small group which is going to be awesome because the small group on Mondays has not been meeting uh for the past month and a half or so or something like that so it's going to be really nice to see everybody again uh the afternoon went well I was super productive I got some editing done and I sent out a bunch of emails to different production companies seeing if they needed help with editing or whatever just offering my services that type of thing um, and yeah, so that was, that was good. Earlier when I was trying to explain how Lyft works, how I thought Lyft works, uh, it doesn't work that way, apparently. Hunter was saying that it's not, you know, first come, first serve, or whatever I was saying earlier, how multiple, multiple drivers were trying to pick up the same passengers or whatever. He said it's not that way. So, either way, it was still a really slow day for Lyft. Woo! All right. So, went to group. Went well. We didn't really do anything. We just kind of hung out uh, for a time. And what's the deal? Park lamps on. There we go, that was weird. I always have my lights set to auto, and for some reason they weren't on auto, so my lights were on, and it was letting me know. I appreciate that. So we just kinda hung out and talked, and that was really nice. And then after that, I went out and drove again for like another three hours, three and a half hours or so, and that proved to be a lot more beneficial or fruitful or whatever the correct word is then the daytime lift is 150 percent more enjoyable in the nighttime so i drove and well that brings us up to where we are right now 
Now I'm gonna eat some food, relax, sleep for a bit. Well, I mean sleep for a good amount of time. And then tomorrow I'm going to drive all day because I have nothing else planned. So tomorrow I'm hoping to be very good for the old bank account. But for today, that is gonna do it. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Okay, so this is really embarrassing, right? It's like 1.30 in the morning. I go and I try and open this door and I realize this is not my apartment. I am on the wrong floor. <laughs> What's worse is that this is not the first time this has happened. You shall speak of this to no one.